Hello and welcome to Low Budget Gaming and welcome to some bad news. Metro Exodus is going to be exclusive to the Epic Game Store. So I was watching my Steam activity page and I saw a lot of people had bought Metro Exodus. So initially I thought okay maybe a lot of people have watched the trailers and stuff and they're deciding to buy it. And then I was browsing through Twitter and I read a tweet that is going to be exclusive now. So I checked out the Steam store page for Metro Exodus and as you can see here there's a notice from Steam. Later today sales of Metro Exodus will be discontinued on Steam due to a publisher decision to make the game exclusive to another PC store, Epic Game Store. The developer and publisher have assured us that all prior sales of the game on Steam will be fulfilled on Steam and Steam owners will be able to access the game and any future updates or DLC through Steam. We think the decision to remove the game is unfair. To Steam customers obviously, especially after a long sales period. We apologize to Steam customers that were expecting it to be available for sale through, uh, through the February 15th release date but we were only recently informed of the decision and given limited time to let everyone know. So basically Steam themselves only found out recently. Right now the game is on sale so I would say that if you don't like the Epic Game Store and you don't want to buy it over there, today is probably the last time to pick this up. So yeah, the standard game and the gold edition and basically what Epic is doing is they're not just picking up games and making them exclusive, they're actually taking games that are already on Steam and putting them on their store and asking them to remove the game from Steam. So you can imagine how much money they are paying these guys. At this point it seems that Metro, the people behind, they don't really care because obviously the money they're getting from Epic is so much that they've decided to it away from Steam. They could have kept it on Steam and Epic as well but clearly Epic wanted them to remove it from Steam so they do want people to come over there. Um, interesting development and uh, it is available on the Epic Game Store. So here we are on the Epic Game Store. It's got the regional pricing as well so as you can see here $20 for the base game and uh, 30 for the gold edition. Now, of course, this is in India. If you're in the US, it should be 60 and 85, I think. So they have the regional pricing. It on Steam, it's about as you saw 11 something, which is about $20 just under. So they are following the regional model. They are actively taking away games from Steam now. So yeah, let me know what you think, but I wasn't expecting this one to go over there simply because obviously all the previous games are here and this was already available to buy for a while on Steam. So my guess was that games that have already been on the store should be fine, but this is not the first one that has done this. Ashen was also on Steam and got removed. There are some games that are timed exclusives to the Epic Game Store. And yeah, I don't know what to make of this. It is a little annoying because a lot of us have a lot of games on Steam. Now, personally, as I've said in the past, I don't really have an issue with uh, multiple platforms and launchers and things like that. But I don't know what Epic is trying to do here because we don't want monopolies. They are actually throwing their Fortnite money and trying to make a monopoly here. Of course, Steam would respond by probably you know lowering their shares their split and things could get back to normal but we'll see how this epic game store experiment pans out um, competition is good competition is healthy hopefully it helps us out in the long run and yeah interesting development though will you still buy the game on uh, steam or will you consider uh, the epic game store let me know thank you for watching see you in the next one